All right, I wanted to just do this one for you in that most of the ones to this point have simplified to whole numbers. Uh, this one won't, so I wanted to walk you through it. You know what, actually, this is between 8 and 9. Instead of doing the exact question, why don't I just create uh, some new numbers? I'm going to do it between the numbers 6 um, and, uh, let's say, 10. So if I want to know the geometric mean, I'm aware that there is a special ratio or a proportion that looks like this. This is very uh, unique in that I'm trying to find a number here that would be the denominator value, but it would also be the numerator value to create uh, the exact correct proportion. This is known as the geometric mean. When we cross multiply, uh, we get uh, x squared equals 60. And when we take the square root of both sides, we get x equals plus or minus the square root of 60. Now notice um, this says exact answers only. And so I want to um, simplify this even further because square root of 60 is exact, but I want to simplify it. So what I do is I think of what numbers uh, that are perfect squares, and let me quickly uh, mark out a few perfect squares, 4, 9, 16, 25, and so on, that go into 60. And I realize that 4 does. 4 times 15 does. And so this simplifies to 2 square root of 15. Do you see um, how... Um, I simplified that by obtaining uh, a perfect square out of the number, and then the square root of 4 becomes perfectly 2 times the square root of 15. So do a similar thing for 8 and 9.